I, I prefer like a more naturalistic approach to making art. I really like drawing from imagination. I sort of like to see the accidents that happen and, and the defects that happen from the image you have in your mind and how it travels and down to your hand and, and what comes out. The only exposure I had to art was uh, comic books. I opened up the pages and you know, in middle school, that was just my introduction into, into the real world. I loved comic books, so SVA was the only school nearby that had a cartooning program, which was very rare, and uh, that made the decision very easy. My name is James Jean. I was an illustration major at SVA class of 2001. This one is from school, yeah. Uh, this made the cover to, I think, the SVA magazine back in the day. This, I think, is from 99 to 2000. So I was doing a lot of life drawing back then, drawing on the subways. When I was in school, I was just sketching all the, all the time, constantly. I knew nothing about art to begin with, and then once you're living in New York, you get exposed to so much stuff immediately. Once I started the program in the foundation year, I fell in love with painting, and I switched to the illustration program at SVA, and I became friends with a lot of other very dedicated, focused um, people, and um, that just really accelerated the rate of, of learning. Yeah, it was like a pressure cooker. It really made things happen fast. sat in on, on every single life drawing class that was available and with different teachers. It was great to be exposed to the whole spectrum and you know from like very graphic designy type of drawing to you know your very classical academic atmospheric type of work. So I got a wide range of skills. A lot of it's self-initiated. That is what I think helped me um, become I think a more independent stronger person is just having to figure stuff out on my own. But the teachers were, were really great and very generous. And to think about how much control you have over your destiny, because you know, I couldn't have imagined you know, being the best cover artist in the comics industry for like six years. It was completely not my intention, but that's what I became known for, and that's how I developed a, a large following. I kind of like how it kind of pulls me in like a different realm or challenges me and almost coming full circle. You know, I've been doing work for a long time. It can be difficult, but I like that challenge. <laughs>